All right, everyone. Wednesday, it's Prince Spaghetti Day. <laughs> and right, remember that commercial for Prince Spaghetti? Oh, Lord Jesus. Yes, yes. We used to have back in the day when I lived with my brother, my grandmother had passed, and uh, uh, he was the cook of the family. It was just me and my brother and sister. And uh, he made what's called. It was the red and white packages, you know, brand spaghetti. We didn't have enough for meat, but we had tomato sauce, like with meat sauce. But we couldn't put hamburger in there. We we were poor folk. So we had our Prince spaghetti. But it wasn't Prince. That was a brand name. So we had to get the, back then it was Farmer Jack. No brand spaghetti. Well, I've been trying for a half an hour to go live on YouTube live and uh, it just keeps spinning. It's, will it go round in circle? So I'm trying out this microphone. Let me know if the sound is any different or maybe I'm doing all this for not and there's no sound. I don't know, but you can't see. I don't know why you can't see the microphone, but I guess that's all right. Well, <laughs> I uh, don't miss Fox News anymore. You guys still watching Fox News after they ousted Tucker Carlson? I mean, you, they just got a major lawsuit. And uh, Rupert Murdoch, Rupert, Rupert had to uh, pay out a big uh, lump sum. And I don't know if it had anything to do, I guess it had to do with the Dominion um, voting machines and some negative... Uh, things being done and being said but it it, it was more than um it was more than uh tucker carlson it was uh uh maria bartiromo the one with the injected lips why do women do why do they do that why do they put that what is it silicone what do they do that for maria bartiromo and another lady and Anyway, it cost Rupa, Rupert Murdoch, <laughs> it cost him much because he's a billionaire. So, we just seen the biggest financial disaster in advertising with the wokeness of Budweiser beer. I don't drink beer. I'm not a drinker. Uh, over Dylan Mulvaney. <laughs> now you got Rupert, 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 what are you doing? You kick out the biggest, most popular conservative voice in American history, making you a trillionaire, Tucker Carlson. So I'm kind of done with Fox. I'm boycotting, boycott, boycotting Fox News. I get up in the morning. I got Newsmax on now. Let me know what you guys uh, watch in the morning. But um, I used to watch, um, Kel you know, Kelly and Company. I'm really going away right now. Kelly and Company. That's what I wish. <laughs> oh, Pastor Dave, you're losing it slowly. Um, you're turning into Joe Biden. Pastor Dave is turning into Joe Biden. But um, Fox and Friends in the morning. And then at 9 o'clock, I love... Dana Perino, a little cute little blonde, and she's really educated. And I think people make, they make fun of her size and everything, but she was the former press secretary to the President of the United States, Bush. And her co-host, she feels uncomfortable. I don't care what anyone says. I can see how she feels uncomfortable. And I probably would too, sitting next to Oh, my, my, my. Bill Hemmer. Bill Hemmers. Bill Hemmers. And every time he reports on something, he's whistling when he talks. And it drives me totally bananas the way he whistles, whistles when he talks. And Dana feels uncomfortable. I don't know. And then you got the fog, the fog, the focus. Are you in the focus? And uh, she's the one that came on and broke the news about Tucker. Real nonchalantly. Oh, by the way, viewers, Tucker got the boo, he's out. And don't cry over 
Lemon got kicked out of CNN too. So on with our day. On with our day. <laughs> Lord Jesus. I want to thank Sister Monica. A shout out for every month on the 25th. Every month yesterday it came up. Uh, the Chapman family, $100 to our ministry and outreach to the homeless. I think I'll try a little bit later to go live again. I don't know what's happening. Let me know the clarity of this microphone. And uh, I'm going to head out. I'm going to head out. The sunshine is really cold. I had a frost uh, warning again last night. I'm going to head out with our ministry and pray for our ministry and outreach to the homeless. And if you would, uh, I'm whistling when I talk. Find it in your heart to support this ministry, the Trumpet of God Ministries. Uh, the link will be below. And we'll talk to you soon.